If you're stuck out here, you're bound to wonder if you could make it out on foot. After all, every day that passes is time running out. So the temptation to get up and go will be huge, but you must resist. But part of me has always wondered how far I'd get, and now I'm about to find out. If you haven't got a hat with you, it's vital that you improvise some sort of shade for your head. And for that, I've brought this piece of parachute nylon with which I can easily make an Arab-style headdress. I'll take that knot, place it at the back of my head, and gather the fabric, and then just wrap that around and tuck it in. Just tuck the rest into my shirt at the back. It's only when you actually try to walk in a desert as arid as this that you realise just how difficult that task is. I've already been going half an hour or so and already I realise that this litre bottle of water is actually just a thimble for. If I'm not to suffer sand blindness like the crew of the Lady Be Good, I need some way of protecting my eyes. And with the sun beating down, you've got to use whatever's to hand. Here we go, a pair of uh, raised sunbands. Perfect if I ever make it back to the King's Road. But none of this is really going to help me here. I'd be lucky to last more than a couple of days. <laughs> 